what you're really giving away in those home DNA tests. Hey everyone, I'm Jessica Suknanan, and this is your Daily Pitch. Home DNA kits have become wildly popular. They're in the news a lot this week after Massachusetts Senator Elizabeth Warren took a 23andMe test to prove her Native American heritage. Companies behind the so-called direct-to-consumer DNA test say they're able to reveal your ancestry, provide health information, and even coach you on workouts and how to eat. But they're also raising serious privacy concerns about customers' most personal data. One company, GED Match, proved instrumental in arresting suspected Golden State killer Joseph James D'Angelo back in April. Law enforcement ran a decades-old crime scene DNA sample through GED Match's database. That gave Sacramento County Sheriff's Department a sense of the suspect's family tree, eventually leading to the arrest. A study published in the journal Science last week found this technique is becoming faster, easier, and more popular with law enforcement agencies, simply because so many people are giving their DNA away in these at-home tests. There's also serious concerns that companies will start mining customers' genetic information for profit. Earlier this year, drug company GSK announced it's investing $300 million in 23andMe. They plan to comb through genetic information for drug development and to identify candidates for clinical trials. The Federal Trade Commission has posted some tips for people thinking about taking one of these DNA tests. They say most companies offer an array of options of how public your information will be, so choose your privacy settings carefully. Hacks happen, so make sure you recognize the risks of unauthorized companies getting access to your genetics. And if you think a genetic testing company isn't living up to their promises, make sure to let the FTC know. For more videos like this, be sure to follow Your Daily Pitch on Facebook and Instagram and subscribe on YouTube. Thanks for joining us today. We'll see you again soon for your next Daily Pitch.